Hello and welcome. My name is Amulya and you are watching Achievement. In this video, I am going to show you how to download and install Drupal 9 on Microsoft Windows 10. So this is alpha release for Drupal 9. This is only for developers not ready for production. So, so, get, so to get Drupal, you simply go ahead and Google Drupal 9 alpha and you will get this uh, very first option you can go to this page and then you can read more about the release so here you see there are two download button go ahead and download this one the download zip now this is going to take some time now in the meanwhile we will go ahead and have a look at the requirement sister system requirement so backend you can see PHP dependency updates you need to have 7.3 and above so it says Drupal now 9 now requires at least PHP 7.3 and above now they have updated Symphony from 3 to 4.3.3 our twig has also been updated to 2.10 and there are a few deprecations here you can read guzzles minimum version was updated to 6.5 so these are back-end dependencies front-end CSS and JavaScript dependency updates they will continue to use CK editor 4 and jQuery 3.4 and these are few more updates in Drupal 9 so you can come on this page and have a look at the release date if you want to upgrade from 7 8 to 9 this is the page where you need to go now I assume that you already have downloaded this Drupal 9 alpha release zip folder now let's go ahead and extract it so it's taking a bit longer on my system I don't know why I already have downloaded one in the downloads folder here so this is what is being downloaded and this is already downloaded so once it's downloaded we need to go ahead and extract it so I'm going to extract to this folder now this will take some time in the meanwhile you can see I've got PHP 7.4.2 and I also have my Apache 2.4.2 installed and I've got MySQL 8 installed on the system so let's go ahead and locate Apache so here it is Apache 2.4 we need to get into this uh, HDDocs folder so there is a possibility you might be using XAMPP or WAMP or similar software so go ahead and locate the HDDocs in your stack and once it's done let's go ahead and see if it's been extracted so now it's not been extracted so in the meanwhile what I'm going to do I'm going to quickly create a database so go ahead and log into your MySQL or MariaDB database so here we are I'm in the database this is MySQL 8.0.19 so I'm going to create a database so database I'm going to name it drop demo and that's been created mm -mm. so here we have drop demo now I can go ahead and close this so make sure you already have your database created you know your username database username and the password and so in a moment it's almost done so you can see it says okay so that's that has been extracted now let's go ahead and open it and here we have Drupal 9 so what I'm going to do I'm going to rename it drop demo 
drop demo and what we need to do we need to simply go ahead and drag this drop demo the name is up to you so name whatever you want I'm going to name it drop demo and then just drag this Drupal 9 alpha folder in this HD docs so once you have here go ahead and close everything and go wherever your local host is so on my system it has a port number 8080 if you're using XM you do not have any port you simply go to localhost and the name of the folder so in my case it's drop uh, demo hit enter just type the name of the folder and hit enter you can see Apache 2.4 is running so now you can go ahead and select your language that's going to be English and then save and continue I'm going to choose the standard one if you want to try the demo so you can try the demo one but I'm going to go with the standard save and continue perfect so if you're getting any error by any chance uh, you can go ahead on my channel page and simply so there's one error that you might get and I've already covered in previous videos so you simply go ahead and look up on my channel page and you should get one so I'm going to use MySQL database name is drop demo root I've got a password if you do not have any password don't worry so I do not I'm not going to give any table prefix simply go ahead and save and continue so I did not get any error if you get any error simply go ahead and look up for it there's a possibility you will get error if you're installing Drupal on your system for the very first time if you've got any error simply pause the video and go ahead and check on my channel or you can visit my website tubemint.com and simply search with the error message and you'll get a post and a video as well so we are almost done we are going to configure our website and have a look at this new Drupal 9 installation that's done Thank you for your patience if you're just watching the video if you're trying to install with me then you must be all right so here we go here we go so I'm going to say a Drupal demo Drupal demo uh, just for demonstration purpose admin is going to be admin everything is going to be admin easy to remember perfectly fine email address what is that India yeah, this is going to be your local time check for updates receive email notification save and continue so here we go Okay, so mm -mm. we are here. So, this is basically Drupal 9. Alrighty, so that's it for this video. Let's quickly go ahead and check 
so i'm already logged in because i have saved everything here on this text uh, browser so you still get this theme i don't see anything new here go to appearance hmm so they are being updated these themes are being updated all right that's it for this video if you have any question suggestion leave in the comment below i will try to answer it asap thank you so much for watching this video and have a good day bye for now